Hello everybody, my name is Tubus Blunt, and welcome back to the South Park Fractured Butthole Let's Play, and last time we... I don't remember. Solved some of Mitch Connor's riddles. Oh, that's right, Mitch Connor that's the farting vigilante. took control of Cartman and destroyed the giant Where's franchise plan. Else? Yeah. Doesn't matter. There's no time. Let's get this fat turd while we can. All right, one, two, three. Oh my god, look! Where, where, where? If it isn't the Freedom Pals and their newest recruit. What have you done with the new kid's parents, fat ass? Nothing yet. But when I'm finished with you, I can't say they'll be exactly safe. This has gone far enough. We end it now. The only thing about to end is you, Mysterio. We aren't gonna fight you, Carmen. Now put your stupid hand down and stop playing games. We have to stop him, you guys. He's got all the new kids' followers now. Even with their help, you can't stop me, King. We'll see about that, motherfucker. All right, Cartman. You want us to kill Mitch Connor? We'll fucking kill him. <laughs> we need to stop Mitch Connor, guys. Just try not to hit me. The whole thing is making me queasy. Yeah, I don't think I can hit him from here. Nope. Glad to be working with you, new kid. Well... How stupid do you think we are, Eric? How stupid do you think we are, Eric? Catch my girl, you're so annoying. Oh, oh, can't you see Mitch is using me as a human shield? Stop before I break your fucking hand. Not if I break you first, Mysterion, which I will. Anyone can be mayor if they just work hard enough. <laughs> no, Connor, not cool. I think I deserve another turn after that. Is this guy really fucked? But we all saw it. You don't get to go. You don't get to go. I don't know, guys. Maybe the coach not making this up. Exactly. Well, where'd he go? Thank you. Why is he oh, okay. I'm just like, why is he over there? Poor King. You seem to be taking all the damage. Yeah, because these guys can't aim. Did somebody What do you mean we can't aim? You're you're standing in one place, Cartman. Asshole. Your coon friends don't seem very friendly towards you now, Keen. Just shut up, Connor. Hmm. Can't do anything to him. Step aside, coon friends. Daddy's home. How does it feel having your friend's blood on your hands, Keen? That afflicts burning, too. Hey, that's not fair! Okay, and you're chilled. You cheating asshole! Going for blood, guys! Coon and friend. Hmm. Maybe I'm leaning towards freedom, pal. Oop. Should have done the extra turn. Whatever. Yeah, my lord. Douchebag. New kid. I swear, I, I'm just an innocent. I actually didn't take any damage there. I'm about ready to detonate some social media accounts. And now we can't physically attack him. Because then if we do, we get damage back to us. Oh my god. <laughs> ah. Ah, damn it, Connor, stop hurting my friends. Friends? What friends? That chills you too. I 
and I'm not gonna be able to take him out if I hit my ult. It's all right though. I'll use it. Ooh, plus the bleeding damage. Hell yeah. And oh, that's right, the fast travel's over here. Need to get somewhere for fit, 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 fit quickly. I don't know why I bothered <laughs> that sound effect. Uh. Yeah, I'm right here. Probably could have beat you to the base as soon as you were still talking. I'm a speedster, but I got help from another speedster to fast child me here. Because that makes sense. I am not your enemy. You're going to talk, Cartman. New kid, you're going to have to make Cartman talk. What? What are you going to do with that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you guys are wasting your time. I'm the coon. Torture doesn't work against me, remember? So what? I, I just have to watch you eat? Is that it? I'm, I'm not afraid. That asparagus is sure gonna make your fart smell bad. <laughs> See? It, it doesn't even faze me. Broccoli? I, I'm not afraid of broccoli. It gets a bad rap if you ask me. No, fuck. Not... No, not even a little bit. I can gobble those farts up. See? Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> oh, this is so weak. I love how I eat the aluminum foil, too. No, oh, no, no, no. No, those farts don't bother me at all. Hit him again. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, I, I guess we're done here, huh? Can someone reach around and get this knot? Oh, hey, come on, you don't really want to eat my puke, do you? Oh, not Too that late. gross, you guys. Oh, God. Yeah, you guys might as well give up. They're not... I didn't realize I could do it multiple times. Oh, God, the cats! What cats? I just remembered. Connor! I think the, the fudge just my memory. The, he said something about making cats more powerful than... The, the, yeah, that's it. He must... He must want to genetically alter the cats. The genetics lab, Dr. Mephesto. Yes, that must be it, Cass. <laughs> so gross. <laughs> okay, so we gotta go to Mephesto's lab. Which is... All the way over here. So we gotta go to Stark Pond. Hey, new kid, where to? Better run 
or the church. Yeah, we're in the home stretch of the game right now. We'll say that. I actually don't remember if we even, like, came up this way. I don't think so. Oop. Oop. Nope. Clear as day, but I still went for it. I already went this way. Okay. All right, the new kid's here. Come on, new kid. Can I help you? Yeah, hi. We signed up for the tour. Ah, uh, yes, the night tour, correct? Uh, yeah, we're a little early. Well, I'm afraid for safety purposes, the tours are only offered from 10 p.m. to midnight. What, just to be extra spooky? It'll be worth the wait, my friends. See you tonight. Shit. Well, now what do we do? We'll just have to wait. We can't afford to let anyone else go in or out of this gate. I agree, we're just gonna have to wait here till nighttime. Okay, how far away is that? Uh, about six hours. All right, just wait six hours and we're good to go. How long now? Still about six hours. Okay, cool. This sir is gonna be exciting in six hours. Shut up, Scott. Did anybody bring any uh, snacks or anything? Yeah, we should have brought snacks. Oh, God, okay, how long now? Right around six hours still. Jesus, fuck. You know, kid, you still have yet to tap the full potential of your time-bending ass. 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 Something that could enhance your ability could possibly make time pass more quickly. 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 You see that AC fan over there? Right there, behind you. Over by the gate. On the left side. Can't miss it. If you fart into that fan, the oscillation of the gas will filter it through the expansion valve, mixing it with the pressurized refrigerant inside the condenser coils. 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 Don't question if that makes any sense, kid. Just fart in the fan. Go on. I'll fire it up for you right now. Some young people interested in genetic engineering, huh? Wonderful, please come in. Oh, hello. Oh, there's more. Hello, sir. My, my, there's a lot of you. Timmy! Well, I'm so pleased that you children are interested in genetic engineering. Genetic science began as a simple question. Can a monkey be made to have four asses instead of one? The answer was yes. And now we've been able to give more asses to pigs, horses, everything you can imagine. Yes, little boy. How did that help? Oh, you're one of the cynics, huh? Well, meet me over here for the tour and I'll show you how. Come on, don't be shy. We don't want to miss the four asses gorilla feeding. Please have a seat. You ever play that video game Half-Life? Okay, here we go. <laughs> Half-Life. <laughs> here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers, 
Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, you Bible thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up to the second level, shall we? Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So, you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. The problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So, you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pals? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go up top. Guys? Guys, it's me, the kid. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pass. Many asked cats. Yep. <clears throat> Should have done one of their cats. You can spread viruses on social media, right? Because that makes us twinsies. You're making me itchy. <laughs> oh, no weakness. Spread viruses online ugly. makes us twinsies. Whoa. It's 
It's alright. After this fight, I'll die in the episode. Welcome, but I'm afraid you're still hopelessly outassed. It's gonna take a scientific approach to solve this one. Oh, I think this is it. Oh, no, I just let more cats out. Those kitties look kind of cute, but they're not. Oh, well, catastrophic failure in the aquarium. Why is that even a button? You don't get to go. Wait, did they get healed anyway? Wait, what? Or no? Watch out for their claws. I'm and really butts. confused. Why do I get plus bleeding still? Protected, never mind. Good to go, and so is my bug jar. So, yeah, yeah, that might have messed up the other generator. So, I get to hit all of them. Wow, that's impressive. My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. Let's one go into this bag. Yeah. Okay, so. No, maybe if I just press buttons. I don't think they're gonna keep talking. So, that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to drop a like on this video. If you want to see more content like this, and stay tuned with this let's play. Make sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification button. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.